So CJ Soku and his baby mother Nike are going back and forth for the internet over their daughter Kamari. Now originally it was scheduled for Kamari to come to CJ Soku house for the summer and she was supposed to be there last weekend. Then Kamari posted to the internet that she wasn't coming to her father's house anymore due to family reasons, which CJ Soku got upset and posted a video claiming it wasn't about family reasons. It was really his baby mother Nike's fault why Kamari wasn't coming for the summer anymore. And she definitely switched up and she's not coming and she let me know as soon as that phone picked up that it wasn't her mom um fault it's not my mama fault it's not my mama fault it's gonna be in my head for the rest of my life i don't want to come this summer i'm like whoa that's crazy first of all she was supposed to come for the year but then some stuff happened behind the scenes between her and her mom me and her mom so i might as well just let that be said before it comes out later i'm just letting everything be said i ain't holding back i thought in my head that it would be a good idea to tell her mom up front that if kamari lived here for a year I wasn't going to pay her child support because I was going to be the one supporting the child. Um, so she got mad instantly. Yesterday I said, are you coming today? And she was, she was like, no. I was saying, why? Confused, confused. And then she was like, I want to stay with my friends. What to and me? I was like, Let me see that. Prove that to me. Let me see, man. It says... Why Hello. I thought you was coming today. Bro, my dad's know. recording right now. I don't want to come now. IDW means I don't want. Right Why? Hello? Because I want to be with my friends. Do you have a problem? What the freak? So Kamari quickly texted her father after seeing his video and people were also commenting underneath her and her mom's page. Someone said underneath Kamari's page, it'll be way funner if you go to your dad's house, please go. You should really go to your dad's house, like seriously. So Kamari felt pressure from CJ So Cool as well as the fans. So she quickly texted her dad, which CJ So Cool did post up the text message. Kamari texted him, she said, I'm coming on the 16th, don't worry, I changed my mind after the video. And then CJ So Cool responded, he said, thank God because I was so hurt. Now you made me happy all over again. I love you, baby girl. Can't wait to pick you up on the 16th. Kamari said after seeing my video, she wants to come now. Now, even though Kamari did agree to come to her father's house, a lot of people felt it was wrong of CJ So Cool to make the video. These are the comments that was underneath the video that he posted yesterday. Someone commented, growing up in a situation like Kamari, sometimes it's not what anyone has done, particularly like you said, she's older, she's growing into her own. I think she's just getting to the age where she wants to make her own decisions. And if she asks you not to blame her mom, don't blame her mom, especially on social media. You're just gonna push her away even more it's not about the child support maybe it's the way she's being treated by the other children or maybe she just wants you to spend time with her in her world not everything revolves around the other kids go see her spend some personal time with her that's all she wants she should come for a little while and then go back she doesn't have to come for the whole summer at the end of the day cj you shouldn't have put your personal business out like that you just have to accept the fact that kamari is getting older and she doesn't just want money from you every time she visits communication is key i personally feel like kamari should have her own room no matter what the situation is don't get mad at Kamari obviously is something in the house that makes her feel uncomfortable to where she don't want to come. Don't just be one-sided. Everything's not about money or material things, CJ. Kamari is just getting to the age where she understands what's what. Now you treat her differently than the other kids. She's your blood. You're complaining about child support and spending money on her, but never once have you complained about spending money on the other kids. She just wants your time. That's all. Go pick her up. Even if you don't go pick her up, go to her state and spend some time with her. Let me know your thoughts down below because I know part two is coming because Nike is going to respond. So y'all hit that subscribe button and turn on them notifications now yesterday diara hit 1 million on youtube and she took to instagram live to celebrate listen <laughs> people are joining hey y'all Y'all, we did it. <laughs> I'm, I literally was crying, y'all, because this is just like a huge, huge moment. Um, and I vlogged it to like document when I actually hit it. But y'all, if you don't know, wait. Y'all see? One million, y'all, we did it! <laughs> this is literally such a random freaking time, a random day to literally just hit a million, y'all. Um, I literally been <laughs> sleep all day because I just got back home from vacation and then got to go right back out of the country. But y'all, thank y'all so freaking much. Y'all don't understand how much this means to me. <laughs> I 
I'm a G, y'all. I'm gonna keep it cute. I'm gonna keep it cute. I'm gonna keep it cute. <laughs> this is so crazy. Like, y'all don't understand. Your girl really been motherfucking working so fucking hard. And I did this shit. We did this shit without y'all, without all my supporters, without my family, without my friends, without my freaking editors, without my team, my whole team. <laughs> it wouldn't have been possible, y'all. But we did it. And I'm just so freaking happy. June 14th, y'all. That is the day to remember. Y'all know my grand lady birthday is June 12th. So literally, the 14th, I hit a million. So we know. He looking down and he happy. But y'all, we did it. One million. One million. One million subscribers, y'all. You see that? We did it. Y'all, 39 videos is what that fucking says. 39. 39 videos. Only 39 videos and 36 million channel views, and we are at a million in eight motherfucking months, baby. Who the fuck do you know? <laughs> we did it! Y'all, I'm talking my shit. So y'all be prepared. Okay, I went live so that I can share this moment with y'all right now live, but I also filmed it too. But. I got so many other vlogs and videos that's going to go way before this. And then I got a photo shoot for my one million. <sighs> and then I was just talking to Matter of fact, Matter of fact, oh, I can't even call him. Dang, I got to get my other phone. But I just need to call my partner manager, y'all, at YouTube. Because she literally was like, you're going to hit us today. You're going to hit us today. And then, <sighs> so y'all, and then go to the freaking YouTube headquarters so they can hand me Hand me my one million subscriber plaque, baby. Not mail it. Hand it directly to Z <laughs> at the YouTube headquarters because y'all know YouTube is my fam. I love them so much and they love me so much. We did it. We did it. We did it. Y'all, and, and then this, this is the crazy part because when I first announced, before I even announced my channel, like, I don't know, a lot of people found it. Not a lot, but like, it was about 10 people. That was subscribed already before I even announced my channel. And I was like, dang, how did they find it? How did they even know it's me? But I announced it. And then when I first announced my um, channel, it like shot up to like 200. And then when I post my first video, it shot up to like 300,000. And then like literally a day after, a day after, literally it was the day after I announced my channel. After I announced my channel, the day after my green lady passed away. Literally the day after. So I like literally went ghost for so long. Trying to get myself together from that. And then came back, posted my first video. Then just started posting, 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 posting. And boom, we are in a full circle. Back. Now it's today. It's June 14th. And we had a million. Now, y'all, it's the road to 2 million, so let's see if we can do that. 2 million in 8 months, too, baby, or less. But I know anything is possible, baby. We can do it. Y'all did it. I'm a part of the 200 crew. Y'all, thank y'all so much. A milli, a milli, a milli, a milli. I don't even have my hair done. I get my hair done tomorrow, y'all. Ooh, I'm all over the place. Somebody coming to the are you coming oh coming to the Cali headquarters? Yeah, the um YouTube headquarters, but I think the main one is in San Francisco, so I think it might be that one. Thank you guys. We on the way to the diamond, baby. Period. You did it, yes. Yes, yes, yes. We did, we did. And y'all, I literally have so many freaking pictures from um my aruba trip that i gotta post but y'all know i like posting in sync like i like posting everything in order so like if i have stuff that i haven't posted i'm gonna do that before i do that but y'all i got all the aruba content coming i got a vlog for that and then my next vacation i got that for y'all so y'all be on the lookout for that b-o-s-s -S. Same year, y'all. The same year I announced my brand. It's the same year I hit a million. 
I announced my brand sold out in under eight minutes, baby. And then hit a million subscribers on YouTube in under eight months. At eight months. Under a year. We hit a million. We did it. We did it. Y'all. I can't wait for the next vlog vlog, right? Because the next vlog vlog is going to be the Aruba vlog. Yes, y'all. I've been to Aruba. I was out there for literally like six days. And y'all know I don't really post when I'm traveling. I wait till I back home. <laughs> they say, oh, wait, you went to Aruba? Yes, y'all. I've been on my Aruba trip already. <laughs> I literally just got back yesterday. I literally just got back from Aruba yesterday. I went to Aruba the 8th. The 8th. Yep, the 8th. Y'all see the skin, baby. She happy and glowing. Mm. Matter of fact, wait. Where is that? See, look, y'all. Y'all know I'll be collecting shot glasses, but this is the one I got. I brought back from Aruba. So I literally have all the shot glasses that I collect over time from all the countries I visit. And this one was from Thailand. This one is Aruba. The next up, we're going to have St. Martin. And then next up, we're going to have London. So, y'all, I'm, pl I'm planning on coming to London. I really want to come, like... Next month, the earliest is really when I want to come because I'm trying to get make my way out to London because one, I never been to London, and two, I'm trying to do it up for my editors because if y'all don't know, my editors are in London, so I'm trying to fly out there and just like do it up for them, like take them out and you know treat them nice, baby, because my editors they in London. But they gets the job done. And y'all love the videos. I love the videos. They know how I like my videos. Like, literally, I rarely, rarely ever have to ask them to change stuff. I rarely ever have to just tell them what to do. Like, they just do what they do because they know what I like already. So, I don't even have to tell them what to do. So, I got to really do it for them. So, I really want to go. I really want to go to London probably next month. But I know for a fact it's probably not going to happen because I have not one, not two, but three. Three campaign shoots coming up. That's literally going to be end of June. I mean, end of July, beginning of August. And then, oh, speaking of my editors, they are texting me right now. Editors, if y'all are on this live, <laughs> thank y'all. We love y'all. Everybody say it. We love y'all. We love your editors. Take a shot. Oh, my God. They want me to take a shot. Okay, I'll take a shot, y'all. We're going to take the shot in the Aruba shot glass since I literally just got it. <laughs> Alright, y'all. This is the shot. But wait, I got to get my chaser because... Alright y'all, we're about to take a shot. I'm about to take the shot and then I'm about to get off after this probably. We love the editors. Yes, y'all. So next time y'all decide to come for me and be like, what's taking so long? It's because my editors are taking a precious time to make things perfect how I like it. And make my videos perfect how I like it. All right, y'all, here goes the shot. Cheers to one million, baby. One million in under a year with only 39 videos. Woo! Woo! Y'all, look at this. <laughs> My cat's just walking around ready to eat. And I'm over here on live. Shot o'clock. D is the goat. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> we did it. Thank y'all. Thank y'all for all the congratulations. 
I literally got to take myself to bed because I got a lash appointment early. Then I got to get my hair done. Then I have to repack <laughs> again for my next vacation. Mm. I didn't even realize. Where did that even come from? Oh, wow. I did not over this thing, y'all. All right, y'all. So, I'm about to get ready to get off. I love you all so much. And thank you all again. We're about to be lit. We had a million. So, stay tuned for what I have to come. It's going to be lit. Love y'all. Bye. Good night.